case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2010, the United States District Court for the Southern District of Florida heard a case called in rechecking account overdraft litigation. The case centered around the idea that state laws can still apply to banks even if they are nationally chartered, unless they conflict with federal law. Fifteen customers filed complaints against federally chartered banks, claiming that the banks were maximizing overdraft fee revenue by debiting charges from largest to smallest. The customers accused the banks of breach of contract, unconscionability, conversion, unjust enrichment, and violation of consumer protection statutes. The banks attempted to dismiss all claims based on federal preemption under the National Bank Act and authorization in contracts for posting from high to low. However, the court found that the bank's practices were not authorized by federal law, allowing the customers to pursue claims for breach of contract, unconscionability, and conversion, since state law claims on overdraft fees are not preempted if they do not conflict with the National Bank Act. The plaintiff's claims were not preempted by federal law, allowing them to proceed in state court. They sufficiently alleged both procedural and substantive unconscionability. However, claims under the Massachusetts, West Virginia, and California CLRA were dismissed due to non-compliance with pre-lawsuit notice requirements. The plaintiffs were ordered to file amended complaints within 30 days, in line with the court's rulings. The case involves multiple coordinated pretrial proceedings and is ongoing. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.